We're shopping for food for nine people for two days. Every family meal starts with a trip to the grocery store. Once we decide on a menu, we will print it out on a napkin. This family might not look like yours, but during their 48 hour shifts together every week, some snacks. West Metro firefighters consider each other family too. Musket, you need to drive that thing. And family has to eat. So we all pitch in $25 each for the shift. So we got about 200 bucks to spend on two lunches two dinners and a breakfast. Bread to go with our pasta. Tonight is pasta night. And what Italian meal isn't right without garlic bread. I work two days out of every six at the firehouse. I don't see my family. They don't get to see me. So this is my other family. And like a family, dinner time is spent together. We call it family time, where we just unwind. We have fun. We don't stress about the work that needs to be done. My sous chefs here. <laughs> um, they're just chopping up the veggies and um, we're putting fresh basil in. And sometimes duty calls before the meal is done. Or it's not uncommon that in the middle of cooking you have to shut off the ovens in the stove and everybody leaves. And then you come back to a half cooked meal and start over. When the food is ready, the dinner bell is tradition too. Come eat. That didn't sound right. <laughs> I think you missed a couple notes. Always with a side of sass, dinner is served. Thanks, Dave. You're welcome, Brian. The family always eats together. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. It's a good batch. But mealtime traditions don't end there. Uh, this is the card game to determine who is going to start doing dishes and who will continue to do dishes. And here we go. Seven. I will take that seven. <laughs> this is the most fair, the most democratic way to decide uh, you know, who's going to do the task that nobody really wants to do. <laughs> yes. Oh, you did it. The first two losers get stuck at the sink. Everyone else finishes the game. I got five. The number is five. At the firehouse, the kitchen is the heart of the home. Because that's where everybody else is. And then we just have some conversation before dinner. And we surprisingly never run out of things to talk about during dinner. A break from the chaos of the job, a place to come together and share a meal. Uh, we spend a third of our lives together. We are our families away from families. It is this family's tradition. Jennifer Meckles, Nine News.